What's up guys, Wilson here with our latest project which is this brand new Porsche 992 GTS right behind me. This is GT Silver and the car belongs to another one of our longtime customers and what he's having us do is a full body custom clear guard alpha PPF installation. We will be protecting all of the silver paint on this car and tinting the windows with Spectra Photosync IRD for the highest heat blocking and UV rejection out of all window films in this industry. So let's move this car in. We're going to get this started and at the very end as usual, stay tuned for the final results. Alright guys, this 911 GTS is finally completed and so for the rest of this video uh, we're going to run through some of the work that we did on here to show you the final results but before we do that I have this little gadget here and I'm going to do a quick demo for you to show you the heat rejection prowess of Spectra Photosync IRD which happens to be the exclusive window film that we carry here at Premier. So what this is is a solar spectrum analyzer, a portable one and the most accurate one on the market today. Uh, basically it's re it will read the performance of the window film uh, with NFRC 300 standards which is the highest standards in the window film industry. Here are the two reading areas that we're going to pay attention to. This reads the IR blockage between the range of 900 to 1000 nanometers. This one right here is the one that we will really pay attention to which reads um, the IR blockage between 780 through 1700 nanometers which is where which is the range that you actually feel most of the heat and most of the heat is being generated from the sun. So let's come take a quick look. So here we go. So as you can see, between the range of 900 to 1000 nanometers is blocking 100% of the IR and between the 780 to 1700 nanometer range is blocking over 99% and uh, again this is Spectra Photosync IRD 55% which is a mid-tone shade and even at this mid-tone shade it is performing the way it is uh, which is best in class in this entire industry. Um, this is the reason why we use it here for all of these high-end cars and the one that we use only here at Premier. 
Now, again, this is Spectra PhotoSync IRD 55%. And for those owners who are considering uh, this shade, it, this gives you an idea of what it looks like in combination with this GT Silver paint color and also with a black interior. Now, for the paint protection film, we did a full body custom clear guard alpha PPF installation protecting all of the silver paint on this entire car and uh, the way we do it again with all cars here is custom installed so that it is as seamless as possible so uh, let's actually take a look at a few panels here just to give you an idea of how it is covered because it changes from car to car right so first off on the front bumper this is a one-piece custom installation. Uh, when this is normally done as a pre-cut template, there will be a seam that joins right about here. Many times for Porsches, you may get another seam right about here as well. As you can see, this is done one piece and as seamless as possible. Wherever we could hide the film and wrap the film, we do. And if we can't, if there's no room to wrap, we will bring the film right up to the panel edge so that it looks like there's nothing there at all. Uh, you could see an example of that right over here between the fender and the bumper. If this was a pre-cut template, you would normally get the film sitting a few millimeters away from the edge. This, as you can see, we wrap the film in there to make it as seamless as possible. And we do all of this without having to dismantle bumpers, fenders, lights, or anything like that. And uh, just, again, it just looks so much better doing it this way. Optimizing protection and minimizing seams. That's the only way we do it here at Premiere. And uh, the ultimate goal for any paint protection film should be to make it look like there's nothing on there at all. Now let's take another look at this area right over here on the mirrors. This mirror cap is a one piece installation that covers from the outside all the way to the inside without any joining seams right about there as it would be if this was a pre-cut template. If we take a close look, even in these areas, we wrap the film in so that you don't get any seams sitting on the outside. Now on the doors, I've mentioned this so many times for Porsches, if you look in here, if this was a pre-cut template, you would get a seam that joins together. On lighter colored cars, those seams really show up, which is the main reason why you don't want that at all. This way, we did it as a one-piece install, and uh, even on areas like this surrounding the door handles, we wrap the film into these crevice areas so that, again, the film is not sitting on the outside. Now the last thing I'm going to point out is this area right over here. From the factory, there normally is a shark fin piece that comes right about here and stops right about here. Uh, it doesn't go all the way to the edge of the panel either. So what we did is after we filmed the entire rear quarter panels, we placed another piece right over here with CGA 10, uh, 10 mils film, and we extended that coverage so that it's higher and it goes all the way back here and all the way to the bottom as well. So for Porsche owners, you know that this area gets blasted over time. So this way, all the owner has to do is replace that piece if that happens and not having to redo the entire rear quarter panel. Uh, so guys, another project completed and I want to thank you for watching another one of our videos. And until our next one, please don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and um, we'll see you soon.